It was 1975 when the Hout Bay military spotted the British HMS Echo in their waters. With speed, gunners loaded their cannons and retaliated with spirited fire, causing the British to retreat in the Battle of Hout Bay, which is reenacted every year. But I cannot believe these are the actual cannons that defended Hout Bay in the Battle of Hout Bay. How are they in this incredible condition? This is a 24 pounder, a shot about that size. But it, and it would fire that shot for about 3,000 yards. It's a long way. Whether you hooked it or sliced it, you know, <laughs> that would be a bit of a problem. But you could certainly hit something at, at the range we were working at today. The Hout Bay guns are the oldest working cannons in the world. And 200 years later, they're still firing away thanks to loving restoration of a small group of avid history lovers. Our gunners are going to load a charge into the, into the chamber here. This is called the chamber at this end. He's got a special scoop, and that scoop is placing that charge into the chamber. This is a ram, a rammer, and he's ramming that charge tight. Our gunner is going to put this skewer down into the, into the charge. You can feel that it's gone into that charge. You can see it's also made of brass. And it's made of brass because we don't want any sparks at this stage. Our other gunner is going to use a flask to pour the gunpowder into the vent. This is called the vent. Ewan looks terrified to be in the firing line. Three, two, one, and fire! Hey. Hey. Wow! Did you notice the gun recoil? Yeah, that is... So that's why we got the sandbags around the base. I see. I can't hear anything. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> well, you're, now, you're now an honorary gunner of the order, Honorable Order of Hout Bay Artillery. Oh, wow. I, I feel so proud. With the smell of smoke and gunpowder in the air, Hout Bay visitors soaked up the atmosphere and a little bit of local history. What an incredible experience today. So obviously the guys didn't trust me with a big cannon, so they gave me the small toy to play with, but man, does it pack a punch. I mean, my ears are still zinging. But just to be part of the reenactment of the Battle of Hout Bay today made me realize how important it is to preserve our very rich culture we have here in South Africa. And I was, I was part of history today. And come on, I got to fire an actual cannon. <laughs>